by the looks of things, Black Ops 5 leaks are about to burst wide open. Hey lads, how are you doing? When it comes to Black Ops 5 zombies, I'm telling you right now, it is going to be very different. Zombies will never be the same. The mode that you know and love is dead. This is because we will have a new storyline or a reboot of a storyline, a new director leading the mode, uh, what else do we have? Uh, a new engine, a new generation of consoles, so Zombies is probably going to be reinvented, for better or for worse. Probably worse. We have seen it all before, remember when Treyarch Black Ops 4 ruined our perks, man? Believe me, Treyarch are not deaf, dumb and blind. Uh, actually, no, but they have heard, they have seen the community's reaction to stuff that they did in Black Ops 4, and I can't guarantee you this, but they know where it went wrong. With Black Ops 4, they tried to reinvent the perk system because the old perk system that we had for an entire eight years was kind of unbalanced. There are crutch perks, there's a four perk limit. They tried to change it, but I think most people would agree. In the eyes of most of the community, the Black Ops 4 perk system was just not better and not the answer to our problems, which is why it will most likely not be repeated. I would not completely throw the possibility out the window, but I also doubt that we will just go back to, you know, the, the Black Ops 3 or pre-Black Ops 3 system. Uh, heck, lads, for we know, perks as we know them might be unrecognisable, the entire system. If you look at Black Ops 4, the Chaos storyline, perk machines are these god statues that are fully animated, make sounds, are pretty epic if I'm honest, while in the Aether storyline it's these boring, custom-made looking ass, boring perk machines, which I think just goes to show that this system was not fully fought out or not all the effort went into it, but Treyarch put it in the game anyway. Treyarch saw perks like Quick Revive, Jug and Double Tap as crutch perks and to be totally honest, yes they are, but is that the biggest problem that Zombies has? Is that something that needed to be changed in the first place? Well here's my, my thing to you, even if it is, why not just change it? instead of removing it. Jug, which gives you more health, and Double Tap, which makes your weapons deal more damage, right, very useful in a Zombies game, they are actually some of the cheapest perks in the game, so why not, I don't know, just make them more expensive? So especially in the early game, they aren't as accessible to everyone. I don't know, just like double their prices or something. Jesus Christ, why is my brain so big? Like, I should be sitting at the throne at Treyarch, and I'm not talking about the toilet. But maybe I am because my stomach's kind of hurting. <laughs> Remember the Wonder Fizz, the mystery box of perks? Imagine getting rid of that. Literally, why? Why is it burning in hell when it should be up here in heaven? And also giving us literally a limit of four perks on the map at once. And perk machines not even having their own unique jingles or perk machines. Like, that needs to come back. That like sucked the life, the character out of zombies. Well, some of it at least anyways. Zombies is such a unique, quirky, experimental mode, and perk machines, specifically Perca-Colas, personify that, even though they're not persons. I have brain, it is working at 5% capacity. These atmospheres and characteristics which we have all fallen in love with, and that's probably why one of the reasons why you're here watching this video and probably looking forward to and excited about Black Ops 5 and the return of zombies. It's just like, you know, way back in the day, you're in this spooky, haunted asylum in World War II, but then there's these, like, chalk drawings or these colourful drink machines that are playing jazz music and stuff. It's just that it's just out there vibe that Treyarch captured that we love. It is iconic and I feel even if there's a new storyline or a reboot of the Aether storyline in Black Ops 5, I just think Perca Colas need to stay as Perca Colas, you know what I'm saying? Even if they come under different names, different colours, different like, you know, rebranding, like for example if Jug does come back, Jug is red and white which is often like, you know, thought of with health and stuff, but so is green, the colour green with like health bars and stuff. So maybe Jug could still be called Jug, but it has like a green aesthetic now and a different logo and whatnot. Really important stuff we're talking about here, fellas. Okay, I've been ranting for almost five minutes about perks in Black Ops 3, 4, and 5. So what like what I was saying way back when, like 10 years ago, is the Black Ops 4 perk system, I just 
Treyarch would be even dumber than I thought. It would be incredibly stupid for the Black Ops 4 perk system to return, but at the same time, they changed it in the first place, so I don't know if they're just going to go back to the Black Ops 3 system. I would not be against that though, with maybe some minor changes, like I said, just rebalancing the perks by their pricing. Just something as simple as that. And if not, it would be nice to see a, a hybrid system, because if you say a completely new system, it might just turn out to be even worse. So if there's a hybrid system where there are perks to choose from, and they have their own machines, their own jingles, their own logos and all that, maybe you could have something like priority perks, where there are four perks that you choose, but at the same time there could be other random perk machines that might be unique to each map, and maybe the Wanderfizz could just be there so you could have a chance to get any of the perks, even if a chance is really tiny. Like, even then, you know, something like that. And what about maybe something like the pro perks, or the, what are they called in Black Ops for? It's like the perks have like the, uh, like the special secondary thing, or like the purple perks from Revelations. Stuff along those lines, like ways to upgrade your perks. That is awesome. Lads, I have ranted way too much about a detail like perks in COD Zombies. So stay spicy, and I will see you in the next one. Cheers.